Hey guys, it's Shalicia coming back at you with a new video. I honestly haven't posted a BoxyCharm unboxing since September because I miss November and October's. But I was really excited to share this one with you guys. I personally haven't opened it yet. Opened it yet. But I wanted to on camera with you guys. So it just came a couple days ago and I've been waiting. I even did a chick chat get ready with me. Hopefully that video is posted before this one. If not, look out for it. If it is posted, I'll link it up in a card above. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm Shalicia and I barely ever post. But when I do, it's spammed like a bunch of hauls back to back. Because I like to shop and I have a slight problem. But this is my December Luxie Boxy Charm. I am only subscribed to the regular Boxy Charm boxes like monthly. I haven't decided if I want to do the premium one yet. I haven't really looked into it to be honest. Because I do shop so much. I don't know if it's going to be worth it for me. But we'll see. Maybe I'll revamp for the new year. Not sure yet. I haven't opened it yet. So bear with me. Oh that's such a big. Hold on. There we go. So for this month. It is the whimsy theme. The first thing I see is the Daily Concepts Your Hair Wrap Towel for quickly dry and smoothing experience. It's an anti-frizz towel you easy to use. This is what it looks like in the packaging. Let me open it. For once I have scissors so I'm not incapable of doing this stuff like most videos. So for this hair towel it retails for $18 US and if y'all didn't know your homegirl lives in Canada typically the boxy charm regular box is $25 a month now I believe and then for the deluxe you pay an additional $25 I believe every three months so it's like a quarterly box this is the hair towel it's like a micro fiber towel which helps maintain healthier hair it's a really nice color it's pink it's gonna be really great it has a little button on the front so you can like turban style it and wrap your hair and pin it up like that that's gonna come in very handy when I wash my hair more regularly cuz I've been like the last few days I've been twisting it out like this which I've been getting a lot of compliments on so that might be a new thing for 2020 next is a cause medics Clean and clinical, luxurious. That's what the box looks like. It is a facial roller, and this retails for $69 American. It comes like all packaged really nicely. Looks like this. Oh, it has a nice weight to it. This part spins, like you can see. Has an it the has like the name on it has like beads on it let's see what this says it's a facial roller that is used to improve the visibility of fine lines enhance skin texture and uplift fatigued skin it does come with a little instructional manual manual like so and you can use it on your forehead cheek collarbone upper arm hand neck shoulder cervical spine and calves that's pretty nice like a multi-use like beauty roller that's pretty nice I may try that out I don't really have fine lines or anything like that yet I'm only 31 but it could be on its way you never know like I'm not the most healthiest person I don't really take care of my skin all too much like that and like I said that was $69 next in there is a Too Faced Rich and Dazzling High Shine Sparkling Lip Gloss in Two Night Stand. This lip gloss retails for $21. I've personally never tried a lip gloss from Too Faced Cosmetics, but I really do like their eyeshadows. I am actually wearing the Semi Sweet Chocolate Bar Palette on my eyes today. But it looks like this. It's a really nice pink shade with reflects of gold in it. Definitely can't wait to try that out into the new year. 
because you know I'm not really the biggest fan of lip gloss but you know I do like trying stuff out next is the Ciate London confetti highlight glitter it's a warm glow glitter it is in the shade that's what the packaging looks like super cute and reflective almost like mirrored which reflects onto the actual packaging so this is the ink confetti that's the packaging look at my mess behind me but that's okay oh it's like a mosaic kind of highlight and this might actually work for me because there is some bronzier tones in it and i am of a medium to deeper complexion so that's gonna be pretty nice on the highlights cheekbones i think for this highlight highlighter it retails for $32 American. Next in the box, oh, is the Fresh Soy Face Cleanser. This bad boy right here. It is 150 ml, so 5 fluid ounces. I've tried this before because I've worked at Sephora and I quite enjoyed it. So this is what it looks like. And what's nice, I'm almost out of a new cleanser. So when that one finishes from Glam Glow, I'm definitely going to give this a try. This bad boy retails for $48 American. Sorry, I'm going to be rushing the last little bit, even though it's all seamed rush. My camera battery just went low and it was just at 22%. So I'm going to try to make it happen. Then there's the Elemis Pro Collagen Rose Facial Oil. This bad boy retails for $79. This is what the packaging looks like. It says you use three to four three to four drops on your face and neck. It has a rose scent, but it's not too overpowering. Super excited to try this. It says it is the soothe the appearance smoothing of the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles for all skin types and it's good for sensitive skin as well so that's going to be pretty neat to try out and that like i said retail for 79 dollars next which is kind of leaked but not by much is the m green grass dry oil spray it is for beach hair and this retails for $36. I personally have never heard of this brand before. Is it going to focus on the label? Nope. But I guess it's a multi-purpose dry oil spray formulated to leave your hair feeling non-greasy, etc. Oh. Oh. It looks like you can use it on your body as well. Face it says you can compare pair it with the hand and body for extreme extra moisture. Next, there is the Fairy Tale Storybook Cosmetics Palette. The one I received was I don't know. It says Little Briar Rose. And this retails for $55. Oh, my hand is all over it. But that's what the packaging looks like. And these are the shadows right here. It's a really pretty palette. Only downside is that it's such a thick box. It would be like something that you couldn't store in your drawers if you're one of those people that like to organize. But it's super cute. I do like the shades in here. And I'm definitely going to attempt, not making any promises, to use this palette in a tutorial. Like I said, that retails at $55. And then the final item in this box is the IGK First Class Charcoal Detox Dry Shampoo. This retails for $27. So it's a dry shampoo basically. And this helps deep cleanse level, de detoxify, oil, erasing, scalp, soothing. I typically don't use dry shampoos. 
because I don't. I can give it a try and if it doesn't work for me, I can like, pass it on to my little sister because she has more of a wavy texture because she's mixed and whatnot. But yeah, I can use it on my wigs maybe if I were wearing wigs again and whatnot. But this is my little rushed boxy charm unboxing. Follow me on all my social media. It will be all listed down below. Hopefully, I'll have pictures up in the next week or so of all the products so you can get a closer look. At them. I know this video is kind of like seeing all the influencers and jazz get their boxes right at the beginning of the month or slightly prior but you know up here in Canada things be late all the time from the states which is fine because I don't mind it still shows up and I'm happy with it but yeah until next time until next time guys I'll see you all in another video real real soon bye y'all